Good afternoon, guys. I'm back. Um, I wanted to weigh in on the Kanye West um, fiasco. <laughs> look, look, right? Um, one thing that I do, right, if somebody is deemed crazy, I pay attention to what they're saying. I pay, especially if the media tries to portray or deems them crazy. That's the person that I look at and I study and I watch. And I, you know, if I think it's crazy, then God damn it, it is crazy because I can be out there in the, in the stratosphere, guys. So, if I think it's crazy, it's crazy. But for real, like Dave Chappelle said, you cannot call people crazy. It's dismissive. Early on as a child, when I would see people talking to light, light posts and lamps and stuff, as a child, I knew that that whatever they were talking to was literally talking to them. Why do you think the doctors ask you, like if you go just like in the hospital, if you have like a breakdown or something, or if you like on drugs or something, they'll ask you, do you hear, do you think that the television, people can see you in the TV? Come to find out, they can spot on you in the TV. So they knew this years ago that they're not, telling us you know what i'm saying so it's stuff that the media will hide from us and create um you know people that are highly conscious of the spirit realm will seem crazy to the person that only sees life in 3d the person with no imagination right the other person is going to sound or seem crazy Right now on to the thing about how Kanye West diss black people, right? We all diss black people, but because he's we diss all people. Like if if I say, you know, just say if uh just say if I have a boyfriend and my boyfriend do me wrong, I'd be like, niggas ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? So we all do it. Or the media will try to portray and this is how they do it. Like, if you black, they'll show you another race that's doing a lot of killing, right? And then, so, in your mind, you'll be like, oh, fuck that. Them, them, uh, uh them Mexican, well, whatever, you know, whatever race, um, they crazy, you know? And they'll make that race seem crazy so you can fear that race. But really, what it is, is you. You are the system. Now, all, this is a lot, y'all. This is a lot. But I'm trying to say that more will be revealed. You know, as a child, though, I I knew that whoever was to, that person talking to that lamppost was not crazy, because I had a, I had a my spirit was awoke as a child. You know what I'm saying? So the people who are calling him crazy, I understand that those people are pretty much the robots. They're robots, and they don't understand the spirit realm. Okay, so, you know, don't dismiss people as crazy. Well, you can, but then do we understand where you are in your spirituality? Okay, so that's what I wanted to say. He just black people. He just a number of people, right? Think about this. Money carries a lot of energy. There was a story once where um, the man, well, a couple of men was trying to get some money, trying to get this money and was trying to, I don't know, the money was piled up or something. And then the money crushed two of the guys, but the one guy, I think, stood on top of the money. I forget how it go. But I said all that to say money carries energy. Why do you think it's called pounds? In England, they call it pounds. Because it carries weight. It carries energy. It's heavy. It's dense. Because You know why it's dense? Because that's the karma from it. Because you're cutting down the tree, a living thing, to make something dead, something fiat, something fake. And we all buy into it, right? So the money carries karma. 
unless you realize that you are the Karen, then you will suffer the karma that you, you know, that all of this money comes with, right? So the pounds are heavy and they, they, they talk, that, that money talks to you. That money makes you do things to get more. You know what I'm saying? So you have to keep everything in perspective. You have to keep balance in everything you do. Because if you don't know how to work with energy and you don't know how to be the steward, a good steward of your time, your space, your life, your energy, your spirit, your spiral. If you are not a good steward of these things, then it will consume you. You know what I'm saying? So I can't dismiss him as crazy. I can say that the, the weight of the money of the fiending for more, fiending for attention, fiending for affection to people who really don't jam with you. That's all comes with the weight and the karma of the money. So you have to realize that resources and relationships is the real currency. You are the current. See? That's a corny joke. I made it up though, so don't steal that. But anyways, that's what I wanted to say to weigh in on that. Tell me what you think. Now, I went all over the place to come to that particular point. But do me a favor. Can you weigh in on that and let me know what you really think about the Kanye West thing? Do you think he's crazy? Are you mad at Kanye for, for actually um, dissing black people? Because guess what? You can't buy into this stuff. You can't. You can only buy into what you say, do, feel, and believe. You can't sit there and buy into or put too much stock into what the media is trying to push or to what people are trying to push. Even what I push. You have to go with what God tells you to rock and roll with. Right? Because you on your own particular journey. And if you judge somebody, try to judge them gently. Because it's energy. It's a boomerang. You live by the judgment. That's how you want to go out of here. In judgment. You know how they say you live by the sword, you die by the sword. That, that means energy is just, it's just a spiral. It just comes back to you. Whatever you do, the love, the hate, you know, all of that is yours, your own. It's your own. So, if you're going to judge, judge gently. But please, be honest. If you judge harshly, put it down in the comments. If you think he ain't s, put it down in the comments. We can discuss this. And if you want to, we can actually do... A um, not a round table, but we can do a panel on this particular subject. I love you guys very much. Um, and we'll talk, we'll talk. Um, like, share, subscribe to the channel. Definitely smash the bell so you can be notified when I upload new videos. I love you guys very much. Um, I want you to know that you are the best of them all do me a favor and have an amazing week and a great holiday if you celebrate these things i celebrate every day i celebrate my spirit my spiral my space every freaking day